Can we get a little context here? See, yeah. you know, we got some new luxury. It's a new drop. This is a new, uh, you know, off-white golden ch chalice. He's misleading you. I'm misleading you? Yes. Nah, it's no Khaled. alternative effect the, here. the father of Assad. Promo. DJ Khaled. So there's a second Good looks for the bless, my guy. Second trunk. So basically, very, Khaled is coming out with an album. It's very and generous. he sent over a throne Thanks. in promotion of his album. And this is the, tre the treasure, treasure chest that Joe got for his sneakers. Last time. So we just paired it up for the aesthetic. Oh, oh, nice. However, I will say this. That's a tiny throne. It's wide enough for, you know, the Khaled. DJ Khaled, yeah, it's a little small. It's a little small. He usually it's a goes little small. very big. He goes, However. He blows it out. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about him personally. I'm talking about, you know, he goes over the top. It's always gold. It's always big. But you huh? got the diamond zirconias in here. The, the tough part you know? is you have to mail it, you know? Diamond zirconias. Yeah, the shipping. The shipping was probably brolic. All right, I will say this. With a little photo manipulation, this could be a massive throne. <laughs> Just knock, knock twice if you're scared. Okay? I think it's my hips. Wow. She got it. There you go. Unboxing Liz right now. Rhyme, Assad, and Throne. Rhyme what and Throne? Assad. Assad? Yeah. Christmas is here in the. <laughs> it's Christmas at Complex, and the comfort of colors are so complex. <laughs> okay, Donald Rex. Hell no! No, 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 no! I said, the side is the god. Take it to the throne, off the dome. Better go home. Pass your bedtime. What? Head time, red time. What? Read the story. Hickory dickory dock. What's the clock? I'm on the throne. Pip pop drop in the bathroom. Hell no! Hell no! Hell no! Hell no! Question. Mm -hmm. So, Stacy's mom has four kids. She's got it going on. Okay. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. Stacy's mom has four kids. First kid is named April, second kid is named May, third kid is named June. What's the fourth kid's name? So if this goes above like July. Pretty much wanna keep Where? Where you got it. What, is, wait, was that supposed to be hard? Mm. Is this a trick question? Because it seems really easy. What is it? July. Mm. Oh, okay. Andrew? Um, <laughs> go ahead. Well, what's the answer? So you're talking about Stacy's mom? Yeah. I'd say it was Stacy. Yep. Thank you. Oh! Thank wait, you. wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Have Come a back. nice day. Thank you. All right, we got a familiar face back in the office. What's going on? This man right on? here. Number 57. Okay. You see it? It's on the wall. It's Let on the it. wall. Okay. So I've been schooling you for the past hour. Today's. Uh, session. We're talking about the thumbnails. I gotta brighten up my thumbnails, titles. Yeah. So we're just we're getting into the real nitty gritty. So I changed a bunch of these <laughs> thumbnails for him. Added a filter, all that stuff. Obviously, titles are very important. Brendan actually shot like a jumbotron video for the Houston Texans like two days ago. Yeah. I want to see if I can shoot better cinematics than the Houston Texans production team. Fight. We got the stage lit over Taking there. Fight, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm just trying to see my my camera and editing skills. That's all. Screaming here, though. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 those are unique. All right, we're gonna see who did a better job, me or the Houston Texans production team. Welcome back to Life at Complex. Hello, glad to be back. Okay, so I found- I'm afraid. Life at Com Complex has silly moments, but we also are a learning program. Yes, we're yeah. very intellectual here. So I found three words, yeah. and I wanna see if you know these three vocabulary words. If you don't, that's fine, because we'll go over to Zoe the Wordsmith, <laughs> and she will provide context if need be. Candelabrum. Okay, do you know that? I think so. Isn't that like a candle, like a giant candle formation? Yes, like it's a, like a giant East. candlestick. Anglophile? I don't know what that means. Okay. But using context clues, 
Is it Anglo, like, white? I guess... It... I don't know, that could be totally wrong. I think the definition is... Anglophile. Someone who's really into English stuff. A great love for England. Oh. Or Britain. So, like, it's close. Okay, it's England. Close. Yes. White. Yes, <laughs> that's what I was thinking. Okay, all right. <laughs> Okay, and bombastic. Yeah, bombastic. Like the bombastic. Da, 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 yeah. Yes. <laughs> like that. I would assume bombastic is like full of yourself, making big ass, like impactful assertions. Bombastic, adjective, high sounding but with little meaning, inflating or inflated. So it's kind of like. So yeah, okay, synonyms pompous. I guess you know. You know all of them. I'm a very smart lady. All right, I guess I gotta find like more words for Zoe then. You have 15 seconds to give a review because this is gonna be flagged by YouTube. Go. Uh, of this song or yo, the album? I, I, or yo, the just go. Yo, songs, flames, recipes, Nizzy hustle. The marathon continues, bitch. Big news on Soul Collector side. Maybe not so big for <laughs> the viewers. So I didn't start Soul Collector. I kind of inherited it when I came over to Complex like uh, five or so years ago. So this is like the first time that we actually got to update the logo. And Tommy over here is the guy behind the design, and you can see some of it here. Um, so it's like a little bit more minimal, a little bit more modern. Tommy could probably speak a little bit more about it, but uh, we wanted to keep it um, kind of the same, you know, we don't want to go through too much of a change because there's been like people who've been rocking with the brand since it was like the ISS forums and stuff. So uh, so like the S is pretty similar, the color is still like hint to that blue. So I started using the Soul Collector back in 2008 when there's still like forums, marketplaces, and this was a time before I had PayPal or a mm -hmm. credit card and I was having a friend buy me shoes off Soul Collector. And so I was still around it and then fast forward to 2019, been here for nine months, uh, worked on full size run. And since it was still part of Soul Collector, it's just a refresh I wanted to give Soul mm -hmm. Collector on the site. And this whole thing was just the logo behind it was giving this global treatment of we have so many people using it different access points throughout the years and our following is worldwide like people know about Soul Collector in the past with the magazine the Nike collabs yeah. so just giving that global treatment and that SC pop it's been a long time coming because we haven't had a redesign since like 2015 um, and this is really just phase one um, cause like right now we just have like a new skin on the site, but we're going to be rolling out some new features hopefully within the next six months. Uh, obviously just from a programming standpoint, full size run. And then, uh, some new shows, uh, maybe some other products, maybe I can't, I don't know if I'm allowed to talk about it <laughs> right now. Yeah, don't get it. Yeah, no, yeah, I don't, but, uh, but yeah, this is like phase one of a long plan that we have for growing the brand and bringing the brand into more modern times. Now is a perfect time to just plug Soul Collector and just everybody from the Complex channel just go and yeah. subscribe. Yes. To the Soul Collector channel. At Soul Collector on YouTube, at Soul Collector on every social handle, and Soul Collector Com. Here, scimitar. That's a good one. Whoa, Medieval what is, weapon. What is that? Scimitar. Mean? I think it's like a sword. Scimitar? It's like this pervy sword. Oh shit. Yeah, that's let's do that. Scimitar. Yeah.